energy vibration reading for the Sagittarian Sun Moon and Rising sign it is the second week of November 2017 and the week begins from the week begins from the 6th until the 12th I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back my apologies to all the people who have um, asked me for a reading and the reading was late I'm so sorry um, I, my throat is still not good I'm still just trying to fight to get over this but um, and I'm still in the process of moving <laughs> so um, thank you for supporting my channel welcome all newcomers I hope you will stay um, I want to say to each and every person please remember to listen to your Sun Moon and Rising Sun like and share these videos and I'm so grateful for your support and I'm sending you love thank you for all the messages the likes and shares thank you for really really supporting my channel because you Sagittarius have been doing one of the best jobs ever thank you so much um, I need to do a video about or the sign you guys are one of the luckiest people on this planet okay it's it's sign that you were born on that carries uh, a certain uh, important messages and you guys are one of the luckiest people on this planet and the luck is uh, sometimes you feel yourself not being lucky but you are lucky okay let's see what is happening for you guys in this week it is the week of an air energy or a fire energy and water emotion it's going to be good emotion you have the ace of cups um, you have the ace of cups that is here um, um, and the ace of cups have to do with your work so your boss is at your work and that sort of a thing for some people it's like you're in limbo but not to be in limbo because the ace of cups and with your boss is supervisor that sort of a thing it is looking good for you um, um, in the middle of um, your week for some people it's going to be a sad week for some people it's going to be a week that you're looking um, at your emotional um, imbalance okay and your materialistic needs um, on Thursday you have the four of cups um, you are, um, are actually thinking and planning your way forward with this is good on Friday you have the night of coins the energy of the night of coins that is coming in this is someone who is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this person is between the ages of 20 and 40 and then you have the energy vibration of uh, the page of cups on Saturday which is a wonderful um, good feelings on Saturday the page of cups this is new love you have the ace of cups you begin the week with the ace of cups and you have the page of cups so this is good and then you have the ten of cups so your weekend is going to be very good your weekend is going to be a positive emotional weekend and this is going to be with family for some people and for some people this is a message of love coming in okay I've been told um, um, you know to use only um, one energy okay so let's look and see the energy of what is going on there's a lot of situation um, please um, there is a situation that is happening with your parents you need to connect more with your parents in this week call up your parents do something let's see what else, what other messages were here for um, for the Sagittarius I was wondering you Sagittarius uh, um, you need to rest you need to rest you Sagittarius you need to rest um, you need to rest you need to rest you need to rest you Sagittarius you need to rest okay the eight of cups and you have your energy is the two of swords you are trying to see clearly a situation clearly you're trying to figure out a situation clearly okay so you Sagittarians this week you are trying to figure out and see a situation clearly you know something is of a ray and you are trying to figure out it and ask all you have to do is ask your angel and guide for clarity and uh, um, to this situation whatever is happening okay remember um, there is two energies sometimes I get two energies sometimes I get one 
for some people you're in the angman position you're trying to find your inner light you're looking for your inner light for some people there is mysterious things that is going to happen on Monday that you're going to find very strange but anyway um, the energy of uh, a love with the ace of cups this is a wonderful positive energy that is coming in and um, the ace of uh, the message of love that because it's the ace of cups the ace of cups is um, new love but yet still new materialistic new financial endeavor is going to come in so it's as if for some people you are going to hear of a bonus or you are going to get extra hours extra work um, this a sort of a thing um, people are going to be asking you to do um, extra thing whatever is happening this is going to be good this is going to be positive so um, understand that this a change is going to come in your reality with your financial situation and love okay new love and a change is going to come in with your financial situation okay as we go forward we have the energy of the Emperor the energy of the Emperor have a situation to do with the magician and the Emperor and this is good because whatever the situation is when you have the energy of the Emperor and the magician you are seeing that a situation is going on here that is as if your um, supervisors and boss and that sort of a thing see that you are a good person for a, a position that you're working in and they are going to help you um, to make sure that you um, elevate yourself and grow and um, um, make changes in this uh, um, situation okay whatever it is so that is good the crown in from your week you have two energies and some people are going to feel a loss some people are going to feel a loss at something and it's not a job it's maybe a loss emotional loss that sort of a thing and some people are with that loss you're going to gain something much better because the Empress is here and she's saying rest she's saying rest so this week is more of a week of taking um, um, in a rest in a peace in a peace is a week of inner peace and um, whatever you thought you have lost you have gained something that is much better okay because you have the three of swords which that is a loss and the Empress is coming to you the nurturing energy the mother of all things uh, is coming to you to say you need to rest you need to rest you have lost nothing but you are about to gain a lot as we move forward on Thursday we have the energy of the water emotions and this is um, good because you're balancing your emotion the energy of this um, card deck is that you're balancing your emotion you're sitting you're taking time off your resting because the four is always stability you're taking time off your resting and whenever you the four energy comes up it's always resting it's always balanced it's always taking the time off the Queen of Pentacles is coming at you she's bringing you um, help she's going to teach you how you can manage your financial situation and how she's going to um, bring um, um, ways of how you um, can be very financial abundance and let me ask what exactly is her um, what this person is doing if I can find the helping card so whoever this king or queen of Pentacles and these are the Taurus Virgo or the Capricorns they're going to be coming in on Thursday in a good way because you know what I'm seeing is that this person see the um, you know they, they see good possibilities be careful of this woman you know she comes in as a friend but she's jealous she she comes in she's very jealous you know she she wants to come in and connect with you but she it's a love age relationship she's jealous but she wants to be friends with you and it's at your work or if it's not your work it's you know in your private life so this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person who's going to come in your life on Thursday or maybe she's already there but it's a sort of a jealousy that is going on so be aware of it she's coming in and she wants to help you and show you how you can do things but the snake is always two side 
she has she she has two different agendas so be aware of this okay she wants to be a friend but she has an agenda she she has jealousy there's jealousy that is going on so be aware of this this is kind of weird because earth sign people are not really like that anyway let's go Friday we have the knight of coins the knight of coins is someone who is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn and you are going to be receiving messages from this man on Friday and this could be text messages uh, this could be um, emails text messages this sort of a thing whatever it is it's gonna be a message coming in from him and I guess you would like to know who is this man and what the message is this person can be between the ages of 20 and 40 this is what I'm receiving and you're going to be receiving message what is the message that you'll be receiving from this person this person is from afar or overseas and it's a message about money okay so this could be good this is good because um, whatever the situation is is um, a lot of information a lot of messages coming in and it's a, a message that is coming in from um, not where you live but close to where you live and um, the message is coming in about money so maybe this person um, you know wants to tell you how you can manage your financial situation money arising um, from business partners so this is good so um, this is good so you'll be getting a lot of information and that money is coming from a business partner or someone who you were in business with someone who you have lent money to it's coming back oh my god <laughs> so yeah I have this thing I'm very finger so whatever is happening if you lend money out it's gonna come back okay on Saturday you have the energy of the page of cups another wonderful love energy so love is you know wonderful in this week for you because you begin the week with the ace of Pentacles especially with your work people at work and you have the knight of cups this is good so this is new love coming in for uh, some of you and it's going to be new love and um, the message of new love and it's coming from a Pisces a cancer or a Scorpio and this person could be a new comer a new love um, 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 person for you who is going to bring wonderful positive energy in your life this is true love this is um, wonderful positive love this person really means what he says and uh, um, he's he's a dreamy person but yet still this um, energy is good because he knows what he wants and if he finds the right person this is going to be good so on Saturday this is going to be positive on Sunday the weekend good Sunday you have the energy of the ten of cups and this is good um, if there was a situation where someone borrow money from you in your in in, um, in your family um, the you know um, it can return for some people but for some people it's not going to return um, do not lend out any money to anyone in your family or lend out any money if you don't have to um, you know think about it before you do it okay if there was something that you were supposed to pay they're going to see that you have um, they've overcharged you so it's you don't have to pay it okay they're going to see that you uh, they have overcharged you and you don't have to pay so whatever is going on it's it's actually going to be um, very good um, um, there's dual duality for a lot of people whenever it comes on um, to work there is not going to be an ending of your work or nothing like that but um, what is happening here is that the ace of cups and the ace of pentacles on Monday so this is going to be positive money is going to be coming to you um, um, help and emotion people are going to be showing you love on Monday okay it's going to be so wonderful um, on Tuesday you are going to hear something from your boss supervisor or an override instancy or someone in power um, which is good news um, the crowning of the week is some people feel a loss of something and it's emotional loss 
and um, some people are going to be nurtured is a week of balancing your emotion and of taking rest on Thursday someone who is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn uh, wants to connect with you and this person have a jealous streak but wants to be friends with you so be careful because when people want to connect with you with these duality energies you have to be careful because once somebody is, is some is a, a jealous woman who wants to be a friend with you don't do it okay um, and I can't say don't do it it's up to you sometimes uh, the jealousy is because they have seen how much you have um, the jealousy is that they have seen how you have made it through life how you have really really built something for yourself in life and that's a kind of a jealousy inside but I think if people are jealous inside I don't really want to deal with you that's how I am because I can't be jealous I'm never jealous I don't see the reason why I should be jealous if someone has a, on something nice I would say oh my god that is so nice I'm not even going to ask you where you got it. I just think it is good that you have it. It is nice. You're looking good. And I will say it to people, and people do not understand this sort of a thing. I cannot be jealous um, of anything, okay? And especially people who are in relationship or especially girlfriend to girlfriend, I cannot be jealous. I have, I, and, and maybe that's why I have less friends because. Uh, of the chaotic thing that people are jealous and you never know no I, I don't have that I basically yes yeah, stand away from that sort of a negative energies okay there's a lot of people who are going to be one to connect with you and want to work with you a lot of people so um, choose well because there is a lot of openings that is going to happen for you a lot of um, connection people coming in they want to connect with you they want to work with you they realize that you know you're good at something and it's sort of a, um, a situation with this love a thing it is sort of a thing that someone saw how you have made it and they want to connect with you but it's for a reason you know people connect with people for reasons I, I you know but don't be worried it's gonna be a good week love is going to be powerful in this week you have the ace of cups and you have the page of cups new love new people are going to be coming in your life new people are going to be continue if you lent out money um, this money is going to come back there is going to be a message from overseas out of uh, no, not where you live uh, um, uh, out of where you live uh, a message that money is coming into you I'm using the wisdom of the Oracle so let's go forward and see what's happening the tribe yeah it is actually a week of you coming back to be with the tribe um, if some of you were trying something uh, something and you decide that you're going back to do what you always do your career and that sort of a thing maybe you try to do a different career and then you think you know this is what I really love and that sort of a thing so and it's also that a lot of people may be um, going back to where they came from or connecting with people from where they came from or connecting with a group that they feel at home in that sort of a thing and this is um, saying um, um, communities belonging being seen and understood by others like mind connection a sense of family and friendship knowing your place in the world and this is so wonderful so congratulations to you Sagittarius I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back I will speak to you guys next week